Developing news out of Clarksville, the search continues for one of two escaped juveniles. News Channel 5's Jennifer Reyes is live on the scene with more. Jennifer. Well, Vicky, right now the concern is for the safety of this 15-year-old boy who took off running from authorities wearing handcuffs and shackles. Detectives say that he went behind this auto body shop here on Highway 48, deep into the woods. It's going to be getting dark pretty soon, not to mention cold, and that looks to be a pretty scary place to be at night. Montgomery County Sheriff's deputies say that that kid and two other juveniles were actually riding in a vehicle that was on its way to a juvenile detention facility facility south on Highway 48. It came to a complete stop at the intersection of Highway 149, and it's right here that he and another juvenile kicked a back door window open and took off running. One of them went toward 149. A canine unit was able to find him deep into the woods. Detectives say he didn't really put much of a fight and pretty much gave up at the sound of that canine unit, which played a key role in finding him so quickly. K-9 was very key today. Um, we would not have located the suspect that we located without the K-9. It would have been very difficult for us. Um, because, because we got here and we contained the scene, the K-9 was able to do their job. And basically all we did was provide security for the K-9 officer and the dog did the work. So great work uh, for that canine unit, but again, there's still a 15-year-old that's out there. Uh, and sheriff's deputies tell me that the juveniles were actually heading to that detention facility after having uh, met with uh, with, uh, with the court system about some previous charges. They were ordered back to that detention facility. This 15-year-old is described as a Hispanic male. He was wearing regular clothing, a very colorful shirt, and shorts. If you see him, call 911. Reporting live from Montgomery County, I'm Jennifer Reyes, News Channel 5 HD.